We have a meeting? Yeah, we come on guys, we're in that motherfucking grind. Come on. But it took like three out we're three hours late to recording. Yeah. That's that that's that's the joy of it, you know? That's the joy. You're the one who got right us to take three hours late! You're the one who went to the drive-thru. Like, if it was me, like, oh, Jacob's so immature and unprofessional. Dude. We're never going to pop off. And then Jay's like, yeah, I'm going to get a strawberry <laughs> lemonade. <laughs> Jacob. <laughs> I, was, I, I was parched. I was parched. I was parched, he says. I was parched, Bruh. fucking Man, idiot. that's just a sacrifice you have to make, my dude. <laughs> Jake, oh my god! Water. If I'm three hours late, <laughs> what do five so minutes? What do five minutes on it? You can just what do it. five minutes have to decide? Yeah, f five minute extra not gonna matter. And okay, I was parched. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you guys know that half the time when I'm angry, no, three quarters of the time when I'm angry, I'm not usually actually angry. I love you, boys. I know, buddy. I love you, too. I love now, you a lot, Get man. down on your fucking knees. Okay. <laughs> uh, Miners, please uh, cover your ears. Good evening, all you precious super straight retards. It's your favorite podcast, favorite <laughs> podcast. Sadly, despite our best efforts, there remains a small fragment of white women on the face of the planet. But enough about our failure as soldiers of AB's fortune. How you feeling today? Dude. What's that? You feel extra worthless and unlovable? Well, have we got a show for you. That's right. If you feel like getting maligned, mistreated, ripped to shreds, bullied, or just straight up abused, you came to the right place. The Cosmic Cast. I'm here as always with Jacob. Hey, guys. Let me introduce you to Satan. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Ha, ha, ha. We're going to be doing a whole lot of fucking tonight. Jason. Hey, 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 it's me, Joe Swanson from Family Guy. <laughs> and Ari. I am, I am horrified. Super gamey, dude. I am horrified. That is like our most offensive opening to an episode. I never yeah, heard this uh, nigga, Austin so energetic. And yeah, I don't think he said more words than he usually says already. Yeah, this nigga said, welcome, you super straight re <laughs> arse. Like, <laughs> bruh, what the fuck? <laughs> At this point, he's just trying to get us on the map. Great. Sorry, guys. I'm over my word count for today. Uh, you know, like the the sort of um, essay word count that your professor puts on you. Oh, yeah. I put that on myself every single night. Guys, <laughs> every recording. single episode. This, this week's episode, we only get a 5,000 cap, and we're kind of running close on time. So let's just kind of quickly say what we need to say and just hop off. Oh, my God. We should okay, really listen, try to try listen. To Listen, okay. listen. I, yeah, I need to apologize. I, I was... Okay, I was not three hours late. First of all, that is slander. We agreed on seven. <laughs> it's three hours. Then, then, hours then, then, hours then we ago. moved to 7.30. And then I was like, that okay, guys, catch me at eight. Because Jacob already was there at eight. So everybody got in a call at eight. And guess what? We started at nine. So it's not that bad, okay? I was an hour late. We can live through that. We're supposed to start at um, <clears throat> seven. I was parched, okay? I had to stop at the drive thru. <laughs> I was parched. Uh what did you get? Did you get the did you get the strawberry lemonade? I did get a strawberry lemonade. That shit's too. so fucking good from Wendy's. Oh my god. I fucking love the strawberry lemonade. It's really good. That's actually what I was drinking. That's actually what I I'm pretty sure that's what I was drinking during that uh infamous uh <laughs> waffle mayhem episode <laughs> where we get that fucking picture. <laughs> oh god, is that what you had in your hand? A strawberry I lemonade? I think so. I Jesus think so. Christ. That's Guys, that was funny. a callback. That was a good episode. I wonder what Waffle's up to these days. He's dead. That's the actual He's episode. not dead. His computer is just like his computer has just been fucking, and uh, as soon as he gets it fixed, he's going to be with us in a future episode. Don't you worry. Let me rephrase. He's dead to me. <laughs> Why? What did he do to you? I don't know. Like, he didn't do anything. I just, I got to have beef with someone. I guess. I picked let's, Speaking of beef, speaking of beef, uh, there, let's talk about the, uh, let's talk about fucking uh, CLB, Certified Lover Boy. Terrible. Uh, let's do comment of the day first. Oh, yeah, shit. Go ahead. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, Austin's. Austin, do it. Austin, since you're starting the episode. Could somebody post it in the chat so I can do <laughs> it? Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, 
Oh lord, we're shit at this. We're shit at our jobs, boys. We're shit at you, our you, jobs. So you had you had the R slur prepared, but not the comment. Yeah, of the but day. not the comment of the day. <laughs> <It's post. laughs> One second, I'm working. Oh my god, here it is. It's I, I, I just I just it's typed coming. it out. I just typed god. it out. God, nope, nope. Okay, see now. He's got to know the name, see idiot. Now. Jesus Christ. I knew the comment. I didn't know the name. Oh, okay, God damn good. it, oh, Gary. Get okay, with the program. You. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Sorry. Kane says to us, maybe you guys aren't mid. You're full of yeah. shit and you know it, idiot. <laughs> we are so mid. It's unbelievable. Explain why our TikTok is dying. Explain. We are mid. We need to accept Explain it. Explain yourself. <laughs> Fuck, man. I watched one of our episodes and I just had to go mid. Hey, guys, mid. look. Satan is back. Yo, what up there, motherfuckers? You better be listening and watching the TikToks. And if you don't watch the TikToks five times a week, I will come over there and kill you, idiot. Jeez, Satan. Your Twitter what stinks. Is, what is that up with rude. your obsession with Satan right now? Oh, I'm not obsessed with Satan. What? What is up with your obsession with oh, Satan? Oh, no, I'm not obsessed with him. He, we made a deal. He has to be on the podcast, basically. Why? Did What, what did he give you in return? Satan um, is the most corny fucking Twitter account. Yeah. Yeah. God, his, I fucking his... hate him. I fucking Yo, hate him. Yo, Zane, your Twitter account sucks. Thank you all for stealing my bid. No problem. <laughs> love you. Uh, would it be the first time? I no, you. CLB, man. God, it's terrible. Oh my. I bad. haven't it's listened bad. to it. I don't listen I mean, to Drake personally, but I heard his gr- bad. Great, uh, great comment was made that Drake has never been a great artist. And after listening to Donda, obviously he's going to seem trash, but it's just a good commercial album that everybody's going to vibe out to until the next one drops in a year and a year and a half. So here's the thing though. It's too safe. It's too, it's too samey. It's, it's literally like what he's always put out, you know? And it, it, I don't know. It's just, it's and that's just, just not Drake. Me. And that's just, that's Drake. just Drake. That's just, Drake. I mean, yeah. uh, there's like a set of songs I like and I still bump them. I uh, gotta admit because well they're fucking not that bad okay. Uh, Blinding uh, lights was pretty good. That's not Drake. <laughs> Fuck man, I, there's no hope no for this way. album. <laughs> there's no way you did not just do that. So I'm my sorry. my set of song is Fair Trade, Way Too Sexy, TSU, and Too Deep, and Pipe Down. I think Way Too Sexy is simply the funniest shit I've ever heard. Of that's amazing. <laughs> no, honestly, like they, this set of like four or five songs, I'm like, okay, that's a bops, and then the rest. Do they is just cross so fade into each other? Uh, so so. That's Barely. Cool. I like I like when albums do that. Yeah, Way too sexy cute. for my. Uh, it's fun. It's a fun song. It's a I very like fun song. song. Somebody commented on like one of the album reviews for that mm-hmm. album. The first two songs were good enough to trick me into thinking that this was going to be a good album. That's true. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> I, I was getting into it, and then I was like, oh, okay, this is just usual shit. Like from of, as for artistic value, Scare Hours Two was so much better. Mm-hmm. It was new. It was more experimental. It felt like I was like, it's like, it's like, oh, this Drake is actually rapping, and then it's like, it's also like Drake that is calming down, and he's got a kid now, and then now it's just now this album is just I'm the best. I'm Drake, and I also have a kid, but I'm not coming down because it's like, not. I I don't want I don't want niggas I don't want niggas dropping like uh Igor or a fucking or a fucking Donda every fucking album you know I don't need that like sometimes I just want to vibe out to good music but this one it's just there are some good songs and uh, and like the rest of it is just bland it's bland shit it's like typical generic shit and that's depressing that's depressing uh and people saying that this is better than Donda. Are you fucking deaf? Are you deaf? Cause oh my god, you are deaf. It's sad. It's Is it subjectivism? Sad. It's not even subjective. Like it's objectively, like objectively for a fact that Donda is better. I'm sorry. I just can't I can't accept any other opinions. Dude, which album had the glob low gab galab? Question answered. Right. Of course. Of course. It's just boring. I think that's probably the the best way we can describe it. It's just it's bo- boring. But speaking of Donda, Ari, you want to attack it again? You wanna you give give it a final big listen? I need to. I need to. I need to. Say, I need to. Donda is Donda is a good album. I'm sorry, you guys. There are a bunch of people everywhere saying, "Oh, it's it's trying too hard to be different." Good. What's wrong? What's wrong with you? Of course, it's trying. What is what the? Uh, it's trying too hard. What's wrong with you? Do you not like good new music? Do you not I, like- I hate when people say that. I hate when people say, you're trying too hard. Yeah, well, why not? 
why not? Why not put a little fucking effort? Like, you know, like, what's up with you? Do you just not like when people try to step out of their comfort zone? I don't, I don't fucking get it. Maybe, man. maybe that's why our TikToks aren't popping off. Maybe we're trying too hard. We're too avant garde. Yeah, like they don't. We're get too avant garde. We're, we're, okay, we're... how about is we kill each other and then? <laughs> well, eh, that's so bland. We, Everybody does that. I think that's stepping out too. That, I think that's stepping out too let's, far from the fucking box. Let's table this. Yeah, let's let's put that on the fucking uh, chalkboard. Put that on the shelf for a little while. Chalkboard. What the fuck? Like, uh, that's how we'll all die. We'll we'll kill each other in a fucking. <laughs> Fucking, pl- well, uh, fucking okay. Fortnite, well, Fortnite, fucking match. Fortnite, just, Fortnite, and then and then Fortnite I'll do the collab. cracking the whip animation from Wonder Woman. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord! I, I, I don't, oh, I don't lord. get. I, it's so, it's so honestly disheartening when people are like, oh, "You trying to hard? Yeah, why not? Why, why, why not? not? There's a lot of mediocrity already out there. Let me be at least attempting to surpass it." Right. And bro, the music is actually fucking good on Donda. Like there are so many fucking good songs. Like oh my god. Believe what I say is hands down my favorite fucking song in that entire album. Believe what I say is so fucking good. I I I just whatever I like I have have you guys ever used like YouTube my mix or whatever? It's it's, no. it's a few times. It's YouTube's own thing on like where they filter where they put the songs that you listen to like all throughout the app on a single out al- on a single playlist and it kind of like curates it to what do you what do you skip uh do you what do you want to hear more of you know and it's really good i've been using that for when i have like uh long long drives or when i have something to do but uh uh yeah but whenever believe what i say pops on like i play that shit like three extra times you know like uh fucking fucking um leave no child behind oh oh the, the moon incredible ah, come to moon. life come to life ah uh, uh what's the, what's the one uh again it's it ends in again what's the fucking first word though uh come again i don't know this is probably not coming <laughs> never come again. again i don't i don't fucking but yeah donda is so fucking good off the grid bro off the grid are you kidding me i don't i don't get how it's new again it's new again i don't get how people could say it's bad i really don't i really don't get it uh y'all stupid uh, go fuck yourselves. Anyway, that's Donda. That's your me. opinion is mid. Agreed. Agreed. I'm just kidding. I love Donda, man. Uh, that's a good that's a, it's such an incredible album. It's like once in a lifetime kind of uh, um, event too, and like the rollout. I, I people just want to be co- contrarian at this point, mm-hmm. and we just gotta ag- assume and agree that mm-hmm. there's gonna be like that. I gotta rant about something. I put a fucking topic in here and it's called 20 hours. And I remembered precisely how I put it there. I was about to fall asleep. And then I was like, huh, that's a great topic to talk about with the guys. Yet, I don't want to spoil it. So I'm going to put a very ambiguous thing that only I will remember. So I typed out 20 hours at like 10.30 p.m. in the evening. And then I fell asleep. And, and then yesterday, forgot it. I was like, huh, what are the topics for tomorrow? And then I look at it, it says 20 hours. I'm like, hmm, whatever could that mean? <laughs> I still don't know. <laughs> you still don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't know. I still am it's, it's very time much, to record. Very much baffled know. by what did I mean by that? Imagine you remember it like while we're recording. That would be good. No, imagine good, he remembers it after recording. Exactly. As soon as I'm going to s- press stop and we're going to wrap up, and then in the middle of the meeting that we do after every episode, I'm going to be like, huh, guys, 20 hours until these nuts reach your face. Okay. Oh. Is that? <laughs> no, it's not that. It's not oh, that. Oh, thank God. That. No, it's oh not Oh, my that. God. Thank that. God. Thank it's God. I, w- I was going to leave. I was going to leave. If that's <laughs> you were going to wrap up. You're going to I wrap. was going to fucking leave. Like, well, that's a wrap on this week's episode. <laughs> it's clearly been over 5,000 words. We got to go. It's so funny. Speaking of like a D's nuts jokes, it's uh in the server earlier today. <laughs> earlier today, they were talking about like uh the the fan base was talking about like our their favorite bits that we've done. And <laughs> apparently in the server, there's just this love hate relate um love hate relationship with the with the the bit where jason tried so hard to get us with the d's nuts joke 
<laughs> they say it's one of the funniest things and the most painful things they've ever seen. And it's so funny to the me. The pudding one was so long. It's like a it's... ten it's like a fifteen minute or ten minute that long. Made me so <laughs> bad. That made me so you bad. You set it up so bad, bro. I swear to God. Like a British dis- <laughs> It's like a British breakfast. Like, what the fuck did you expect to? And then this nigga kept saying porridge for some fucking reason. Because he said it started with the piano. This nigga the kept item saying porridge. In the UK, <laughs> like, of course it's gonna be porridge, man. <laughs> So me saying like, it's not porridge for five times did not throw you off. Well, I'm and then just this saying, thing goes, I'm just huh, saying, I thought you were wrong. What if it's wrong. porridge this time? What if it's porridge this time? What if it's time? porridge the seventh time we ask him? <laughs> oh my god, bro. Oh god, that bit is so bad, but it's also like the funniest shit ever. <laughs> like, ev- leading up to it, it's brilliant. But then... <laughs> When you get to the part where the fucking joke happens, everything <laughs> dies. All the momentum from the joke just fucking flatlines, and it's so funny. Listen, it's it so wasn't funny. going to be funny even if we did get it right away. So like, oh god, it, like the fact that you insisted on the the, the punchline being made it baffles me, but that's fine. Oh fuck, What's Austin, up? What's up? Austin, are you not talking because you reached your word quota? <laughs> <laughs> are you doing that bit? Uh, (laughs) someone pay for more words someone pay for more words please come on man (laughs) is that the is that the sound effect that you used to pay for shit in the uk it is you can literally (laughs) just go (laughs) cha-ching when have you ever put a quarter in a machine and it went cha-ching you fuck it's literally no cha-ching is literally the fucking money sound effects for most things you fucking idiot i'm sorry this isn't an 80s cartoon my guy i'm sorry that you're dumb and went (laughs) instead of fucking (laughs) cha-ching like people normally know stands for money i have never heard cha-ching in my life you're lying you literally just said i'm sorry this isn't an 80s movie you fucking idiot so you're lying to me you're trying to gaslight me bro you're such a hypocrite (laughs) i cannot imagine how oh my god fucking hell bro what are we doing i've done no wrong in my life what does this podcast come to bro it's it's, it's come come to to these nuts all right no shut the fuck up when should the podcast end like when's like a clear sign now fucking now fucking Fucking now now. what since the fermented piss bit it's just like all right this we gotta we gotta at least make it to 100 like we owe it to ourselves to make it to 100 austin please speak man come on (laughs) (laughs) he's begging you bro it's it's funny it's funny we got the bit (laughs) (laughs) oh oh, god we're sorry in order to unlock more words from the mouth of irony am i you must donate five dollars to the cosmics on patreon (laughs) don't say that that's how we announce that we have a patreon Imagine that's how we announced it. Nobody donates. Wait, we have a Patreon? We have an OnlyFans, idiot. Yeah, guys, we have opened up a Patreon to stuff these nuts into Jason's mouth. Let's go! Five dollars is an extra pair of fucking nuts to stuff in his mouth. Donate a lot. He can take them. <laughs> how, what is the highest tier you can ask for in Patreon? Like, how much? I'm sorry? I think you can go straight up to, like, a million. Right? Because oh. my idea is, like... The last tier is Jason reveals his face and retires. Like, shut him up forever. Yeah, shut Jason up forever tier. Dude, that would be a good episode. Take a hundred million dollars and turn it into 50 tomatoes or something like that. Okay, I got to talk about this. Who's tweeting corny shit from the account? I don't ever tweet from the account like dead serious. Somebody said, I said corny. Oh, corny. I thought you said horny. <laughs> I thought you said corny. <laughs> I just went hey. on the Cosmos account. I see a retweet. It's Jason looking at the mirror and it says whore. <laughs> whore. That's one of my favorite <laughs> tweets. That's one of my favorite tweets from him, bro. That shit is actually funny. That shit is that actually funny. That was a really funny tweet, Oh, I, I got job. back in the game, by the way, recently. I saw that. Right. Oh, dude. Fucking for TikTok. For 100K, Let's baby, go. on TikTok. Let's go. Fucking Shang-Chi, Shang-Chi joke. Shang-Chi feeding the family. <laughs> Dude, I have not watched that yet. I I want to so bad. Come back. I want to so bad. What? The what? joke will what? be even funnier once you watch it. <laughs> watch what? 
What are we Shang watching? Shang Chi. It's a new Marvel movie. It's a new Marvel oh. movie. It's pretty I good. It it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's actually really good. Oh, my last tweet was the um, was the text messages when when uh, when Ari was like, Drake says he was fucking fans. He was shameless in that clip, and Jason's like, he's just like me. Oh fuck, you can't oh, unsend here. Speaking of speaking of clips, we forgot to talk about the fucking the fucking dude who was like who's saying who's your top five, Kendrick? My oh, top yeah. five is Drake. Jake, Jake, <laughs> and, and then he just falls asleep. That was academic. That was so funny. <laughs> it's so funny. Who, who top five are you smoking on, Kendrick? Because my top five is Drake, 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 and <laughs> <laughs> dude. It's so funny because I've seen I've seen like more cl- clips come from him, and like he's so surprised. Like he's been doing polls for um, Donda versus C- uh, CLB. And Donda has won every single one. And he just sits there so surprised on how Donda keeps winning. And it's so funny. The academic's been a known Drake dick rider. Dick a rider? The, the only dick I ride is Playboy Cardi's because I've been listening to a whole lot of Red. And, I got, know, okay, I, I went, I've got to get this off hey, my chest. What? I've got to get this off my chest. Guess what? Hey, Ari, guess what? 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 Joe Biden house. 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 Hold on. I gotta. I gotta. T- I gotta get this off my chest, bro. I do gotta it. Get do it. I know what you're gonna say. Do it. I gotta get this off my bro. Playboy Cardi. It's. I've. I've. I've noticed that I. I can't really vibe with the nigga. I'm sorry. Like I like some of the song. I like some of the nigga songs. His fuck. I don't know who his producer is, but this nigga's like. On another fucking level. This nigga has the best fucking beats on almost every single one of his songs. This like this shit's otherworldly. Like fucking fucking talk to me, bro. Talk to me, bro. That shit's heavenly. That shit's heavenly. This shit's like his beats are out of this world. But then he starts rapping. <laughs> then he starts rapping. <laughs> then this nigga starts rapping. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> no, no, no. You're not stepping away from this shit. <laughs> Jumanah house, Jumanah house, Jumanah house, Jumanah house, Jumanah house, Jumanah house, Jumanah. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. but that was fire. Okay, I'm sorry. I like his song. I like a lot of his songs. There are a lot of his songs that I like. Copyrighted by them. I hope not. There are a lot of his songs I really like. I really like a lot of them. But then there's like some that are like it's literally what people mean when they say fucking when they say fucking mumbo rappers. I'm sorry. It's I don't literally care. what I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I was at work. I was listening to a whole lot of red from front to back. I was I in did not mode. like a whole lot of red. I was slanging I did not dope. like a whole lot of red. I was ready. I was ready. I was ready to conquer the world. I don't care what I, you say. I could see why people didn't like that. Is album, Jason honestly. gonna be our mumble rapper when like art we possibly. start rapping again? Yeah. Yeah. I think so. And, and yes. I'm proud of that. What you know what's so be? sad it's to like... me? You know what's so sad to me? I've heard in Metamorphosis that that um that bar about uh the feel like God bar. I've heard that before, but it was yeah, like a, a remix and stuff like that. And the remix is so much better, bro. It's sad, bro. Cause the, that's like good bars. It's such good bars. It's just that I can't understand the nigga, bro. I can't <laughs> understand him. I mean, he literally says that in the song too. That's, that's funny. That, but that, anyway. that's part of the experience, man. That's part of the experience. You just part of the experience is like, what did this nigga just say? Yeah, that the, the re- re- replayability value, man. Get on the shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's thinking different. Okay, He's fine. built different, bro. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, Playboy Cardi. Uh, go listen to his songs. They're pretty good. Uh, go talk to me. I would recommend talk to me because. Rack, racky, bro. Racky. Wait, you know, Holy you know the funniest shit. part. I dick right Cardi so bad, but whole lot of right is the only album I've ever listened to. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta try his other shit, man. No, you gotta. You can't. You gotta be a truth. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Uh, what's that fucking album? It's not Die rip. Uh, that's one of the songs. That's one of the songs. Die lit. Die lit. Yeah, die lit. Okay, I will admit a lot of the songs on die lit is pretty good. No, uh, no, I, 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 I've been meaning to try that. No, like a lot of the songs honest. are pretty good. I have been meaning to try that one. Yo, Hassan, what did he do again to you? Okay. Okay. He didn't do anything to me because I don't know this nigga personally. But I just wanted to make fun of Hassan like one last time. Oh boy. Is, it, is that, is that the fit? This nigga. Is it it's the obviously fit? the fucking fit. It's obviously the fucking fit. Not the it's fit. obviously the fit. It's the fit, bro. I just, I can't let this nigga get away from me with it after seeing this shit. 
Oh my god. Hold on. I gotta find it. I gotta fucking find this shit again. Uh where is it? Eh, buh, 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 buh. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Okay, I found it. Oh god. Uh, is this a good pick? I don't even think it's a good pick, but who cares? I just need you guys to see this. I just need yeah, you guys to see this. Not, not the fit. Not the fit. Cuffed jeans. Half, oh, half what is this oh nigga wearing? And, and, and he gave us the fucking 144p picture. What is this nigga wearing? And what then is it has a and wearing? it has a make make the rich pay honor kissed uh paint type thing on his t-shirt <gasps> and the cuff jeans. There we go. And Vance oh, and the white socks. Oh nigga, no. <laughs> Not the fit. This nigga looks trash. Did you see what his tweet to say that it's not a bad fit? He's molding. He's fucking molding. He, I he, saw he, that. He's like, well, actually, uh, this one is uh, is actually by my friend who makes anarchist <laughs> merchandise. And then somebody quote tweeted that. I said, that's how I sound when I have a borst fit of all time. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. He's molding, bro. He's Dude. fucking molding. It's Isn't so Isn't this bad. just how Jacob dresses every single day? Come on, man. Don't do him like that. Don't do him like that. That's not at all what he looks like. Jake, Jake doesn't, doesn't wear graphic like tees for fur for one. Yeah, first off. Also, I take personal right. offense because I dress Jacob, so. <laughs> yeah, idiot. You just insulted Jason, dumb fuck. He's trying to push the blame. He's trying to push <laughs> did, the blame. Did, He's trying to push the blame. Did Jacob just fucking crush a beer can with his hand? <laughs> <laughs> that, <noise? laughs> that wasn't me. <laughs> Please tell me you ain't drinking right now, bro. I'm going to start <laughs> Are crying. Are you guys not drinking? Let's go. <laughs> Please tell me you're not drinking. I'm going to start crying. Listen, I'm going to start crying, listen, bro. Ari, oh my God. Ari, he's a grown a, man. I am a 21-year-old man. Okay, bro. I mean, you be... I just, I just worry for your health. God damn it! Year old man, we got a twenty-one year old grown man. I just worry for this your motherfucker health. rapes people with that hat on. I'm just gonna say that right now. Okay. That was really good. That was a really good. That impression. was pretty damn good. <laughs> but uh, I have one last thing to say on Hassan. Like, uh, I was on his, I was on his side for the house thing until I found out that he was a fucking hypocrite because <laughs> there is literally a clip of him, of him talking about uh what's her name what's her fucking name uh um name? sniper wolf sniper nico, wolf oh, okay no sniper wolf getting a house i'm pretty sure it was sniper wolf maybe i'm mixing her up with nico nicolo and being like why do you need a two million dollar house in a blah, 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 you know and uh i guess i guess now <laughs> i guess Hassan now knows i guess he knows now i guess he knows you, you do need a three million dollar house though I guess we know now, buddy. But see, I wanted to defend him, but I uh, I just realized that I don't give a fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. I think I found it. I think I found it. <laughs> okay, I think I found it. CL- Why did I name the topic CLB more like cum? <laughs> <laughs> God, I need to start naming my cum topics is good, properly. Dude. Cum is good. I don't know why you... Why you and CLB is not. 533, by the way. 533. Oh, no, I, uh, I'm not watching a whole. It's 533. Literally just. Okay, it's... okay. Let me play from my phone then. 533. Spoon, 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 well, dude, like how the feet. fuck do people make this much money? $2.9 million near Las Vegas? Dude, oh my fucking lord, dude. You can buy so, a fucking I castle put in Las Vegas. I have a wall of audio phone. And oh, by the way, this is my. Setup oh my god. This is hurting my ears. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, yeah. Like... It's so loud. Hypocrite. Yeah, man. Hypocrite. Funny. That's pretty funny. It is funny. I, I, I don't, think, I don't even think he meant it like that. I think he was just shooting on Sniper, but whatever. Sniper Wolf sucks. I'm not going to yeah, lie. Yeah, fuck Sniper Wolf. I forgot Sniper Wolf existed, to be honest. Like, and How could you? She's I always to, on the homepage. If, if there's yeah, some dumbass... That's not a hold joke on, either. Hold on. If there's Literally, some... anytime you open the homepage, which I have been seeing a lot because for some reason, YouTube has been treating my homepage like I'm signed out, but that's a whole other issue. Like, you must yeah, just you watch her. a lot of hold TV. On, hold on, that, hold on. She, she has never been on my homepage. For some dumbass... It's when, on, it's when you're signed out, man. But anyways, go on. But for some dumbass in the comments or or on TikTok goes, oh, you hate Sniper Wolf because she's a woman. I hate her because she's unfunny. She's not funny. She's like... She's and, not funny. And her funny. videos fucking sucks. Her Eerie, videos Eerie, fucking would, suck. Eri, nobody would say that. Sniper Wolf just sucks. Nobody likes her. <laughs> nobody likes her. She's cringe. Nobody, nobody hates Sniper Wolf because she's a woman. Everybody hates Sniper Wolf because she's a stupid bitch. <laughs> That's not true. That's not funny. And only lame. You can do it. You can say, say that it. shit. No, nope. you can say it. You can say it. Nope. You've done nope. it before. 
Did- I hate Sniper Wolf. She reminds me too much of Pokemon. <laughs> Nobody cares. Oh, Lord. I'm just glad Pokemon's not in the news, bro. I'm tired of talking about her. Can people stop simping over Pokemon? Shit's old. No! <laughs> <laughs> that was a real passionate no. Yeah, that nigga. That came from the soul. That came, it came from, from the, the demon himself. Nah, of the news. Man, nah, man. It came from the wallet. Oh, my. <laughs> oh I see. <laughs> You still oh, got her. Never nice. oh, mind, it wasn't her. <laughs> I was gonna uh, say you still have her bath water, but I was thinking of fucking uh, what's her name. You no. guys feel like you guys feel like getting political real quick. No, no. Well, not really. But... <laughs> not nah, okay. How about how about uh, we talk about human rights? Oh boy, S- still okay. no. Well, that's a little easier. Good. G- the mood, like, you can, dude, we don't do don't human get... rights on the cosmic cast. We kind of do the opposite We're... if you think about it. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. A video. A video game, oh, uh, com- a video game company president. Oh, this dude, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. This dude. Run- I, I wanted to leave it for later, but it's fine. You want to leave it for later? No, at this point, we already started. I don't really care. Let's so, go. Let's go. All right. Uh, this dude was a uh, the president of Tripwire, um, Tripwire. and yeah, that's a video game uh, company. Never heard. Of and it. he put out this tweet. It's talk- always yeah. It's always fucking. It's always the shittiest takes. It's yep. always dudes you never hear from. It's like yep. Oh, uh, it's like that NASCAR driver. Well, I'm not gonna stand for ban of the Confederate flag. And then it's, it's like they put his stats, and he has like zero wins, <laughs> zero, zero pole positions. Yeah, it's it's it sucks though because uh uh. I played a a bit of a bit of this company's games, and oh now I'm just like God. damn. Um, fourteen thousand replies on the tweet, bro. Yeah, yeah. It, they, they were they, be, they, they were beating they, his ass. They, they beat were, your ass in quotes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he said, "Proud of the U.S. Supreme Court affirming the Texas law banning abortions for babies with a heartbeat." As an er- uh, entertainer, I don't get political often. Yeah, with so many vocal peers on the other side of this issue, I felt it was important to go on the record as a pro-life game developer. How about you go suck a dick? I don't know. How about you go fuck off? How about you not try to control what women do to their bodies? I don't know. Maybe maybe stop being a piece of shit. Who knows? Yeah, only we get to decide what happens to women's bodies, guys. It's so fucking bullshit. I don't get how By I don't get how you can cosmic cast. I seriously don't understand how how you could be pro life. Like honestly, I really don't. Like how are you so willing to control how a woman what they do with their body. If they don't want the child, they can they should have the right to, you know, kill it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. He's not wrong. He's not wrong. We He's love wrong. an aggressive He's ally. We love an aggressive ally. You love to hear it. You love to see it. But like, yeah, oh, I don't I don't really get why boy. they're trying so hard to control. And it's so obvious that they are trying to control them too. It's like it it's so bullshit. It's so it's so and like no. they're not gonna take care of the child These when are- it gets born. <laughs> You these think they're gonna the guys, care? These are the guys who made Man Eater and Killing Floor, just like yeah. mediocre bullshit. Man, fuck. I actually out of like. Here. I actually like Killing Floor. Okay. <laughs> I wonder what Satan <laughs> thinks about that. Yo, Satan. Oh my god. Oh, my oh, never god. mind. He's not paying attention. Fucking dick. No, no. Go, go on with the bit. No, I know no, that's no, your not, way of saying no. I don't want to go in the bit. No, okay, he's busy right now. Yo! Let's continue then. Oh. Fucking asshole. All right. Throw guy. something at him. Uh, what should I throw? Throw something at Satan. Beer, Holy beer, water. Beer it would be funny. Oh, I got Tums. Funny prank. <laughs> I got he tums. just melts in front of you. Oh, damn, bro. <laughs> we hey, oh. what's going on down here? Hey, what's your stance on abortion? I don't fucking care. Oh, okay. More more, more babies in hell. I mean, they wouldn't be in hell. <laughs> they wouldn't be in hell. Oh, you hear what he said? He That's pretty abortion. epic. That's pretty cool. Oh, actually, funny enough, it, it, what's up if somebody's listening and and in very, very small demographic of the Cosmic Cast, you're a woman already doubting it, but and you live in Texas, also kind of scary, and you want to get an abortion. God, it's such a precise demographic. So if you're that one person, um, you can actually get in a religious exemption if you say that you're getting an abortion because of the satanic ritual. It's actually legally they have to give it to you, and they can't. That's hilarious. You. That's yeah, hilarious. Like, that's actually a fact. So use that that one person that we're applying this to. Hey, uh, we have the basically, cast. We don't endorse women from Texas. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Just like click off the fucking podcast. 
You're dead to us. <laughs> okay, that's kind of <laughs> I kind of agree with that, honestly. Oh god, Texas, bro. They be breeding the most <laughs> the most hateful shit I've ever seen in my life. My but, uh, dad is the, from the, Texas. The dude so. the dude got got taken down as the CEO. He he got fired and uh he put out a statement. <laughs> I don't, I don't oh, even yeah. want to fucking read this. Yeah, fuck I don't, it. Let's not give a platform. Like this is like this is like four paragraphs. Fuck you, John fuck. Gibson. You fuck. It's three paragraphs, you idiot. But uh, okay. I just, I just the the signature seemed like a fourth one. It was a lot to read. I I agree with you on that. Yeah. Why would we care? Anyways. Fuck you, John Gibson. Austin, introduce us. Introduce us to our new TikTok famous lady. Oh God. Oh what? God. Oh yeah. Oh, oh God! Yeah. Do it, baby. Okay, Austin, you want to take care of it? All right, guys. Have you ever been on TikTok? I doubt it. Leave the ass open. You guys ever on TikTok? <laughs> you guys fuck with TikTok? Oh God, I hate uh, this. Th- what's the deal? Waste what's the deal with TikTok? You know, I went on TikTok for two days, and I just had to think mid. That's all I could think, man. <laughs> all right, there's a girl. But yeah, guys, there was a punk on TikTok. She's been trying to get a lot of attention from saying, I have no friends. And uh, all my friends that I thought were my friends actually betrayed me and hate me and hope that I never succeed. That seems like a trend recently like, with that girl and Logan Paul guy. Like, you guys are fucking lonely. You're sad. losers. You guys are actual losers. That's what you are. Well, this... I think this girl's a little bit worse because instead of just guilting Logan Paul, she's guilting everybody who's watching her, saying like, "Well, I mean, all the the only way that we can hit back at those haters is by getting my song to a million likes just in time for my birthday." Bro, listen, listen to me, listen to me. When we say no more white women, this is the exact kind of person we're talking about. This bitch is the exact person we're talking about. Well, you know what, guys, guys, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, listen. I feel like we we should not be so critical. And I know, I know, I might catch some slack for this because it is a great, easy uh, way to kick down a person right now. But why don't we give it a shot, okay? Let's go over to her Spotify and give it a listen. Maybe the song is not that bad. Okay. Maybe we should just give it a try. It's ass. It's fucking mid, 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 mid. 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 She ass. really fell off. She really God. fell off. No bullshit. Hey, God, hey get guys. out of here. Elf. Remember that? Elf. Remember that? Remember that one lady was like, "Just because you put a year after no more white women doesn't make it not offensive." Did someone really say that? <laughs> you don't remember that? <laughs> no, no. The comment was like, "You hide your." misogyny behind the white and i'm like no <laughs> yeah. what does misogyny? that even mean hold on what does that mean hold on what does that mean hold on. No, hold basically, on. basically they meant like it's like um uh we say no more white women is because it we we um actually we just no misogynist women Women yeah. ain't shit, that dog. That's so funny. So, so they missed the entire so point funny. of the song. The entire point the of the entire song. Entire point of the song. We should make like yeah, guys, I feel like white. I feel we feel like white women are actually often weaponizing uh, their. Uh, it was actually <laughs> weaponizing their tears against uh, everybody. Except it was highlighted by Jacob McDomino in the fourth verse of right. uh, "No More White Women" and by Thaddeus James on the beginning of the verse. Well, However, that, let me miss the entire point of the of the song and critique <laughs> it for misogyny. <laughs> So Actually, stupid. I was just saying that I'm a weeb. That was my whole point. To the song. <laughs> we should make uh, "Yes, White Women" 2021 as like an apology song. Yes, more uh, the apology. Yes, more. But like, we'll make it like extra misogynistic, <laughs> dude. The funny thing about that would be if we start working on that now, it's going to be released as late in this year as "No More White Woman" 2020 was released. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Life. It's hilarious. It's going to re- release like so. It's just not not a, not a "No More White Women." It's more like "No More December 2021" of white <laughs> women. <laughs> no more white women for like a month. Just that's about it. Fuck man, it's 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 just it's just no more. Have we even played the fucking TikTok so that the audience can understand what we're talking about? Oh no, about? no, no, no. We don't need to. We just, we played her song and it was garbage and mid and bitch shit. It, I, I just I can't stand niggas like this too because she also she has copyrighted music. Mister Girl TikTok, makes so. better music, okay. so I don't know what to tell you. True, but listen, I I can't stand bitches Let's get like this on the because, podcast again because. Because, dude, she already had a million subscribers. She already had a million subscribers on her channel. And you might be confused on how she had a million, even though, like, she had, uh, she has, like, a couple songs that they don't even, ha- they don't even break 100,000. But that's because she used to be a reaction channel. 
Let that sink in, man. And we and she wants more now, and she's like, "I have a talent," and I'm like, "Okay, cool, but you gotta prove it." She's you really d- just a knockoff Billie Eilish, and even then, Billie Eilish ain't even all that. Like, it's so crazy because like she literally feels it feels like she she behaves that she's entitled to all that fame, and it's like, no, 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 you are a reaction channel, and don't be surprised that we do not reciprocate the energy about your music no no you gotta prove that you know what you're doing for now my life fucking sucks my music didn't get 20 million plays (laughs) dude dude dude, dude. hold on hold on hold on what what the what the fuck was that little jab at little nas x what the fuck was that well she's racist idiot that felt a little that felt a little racially (laughs) and and sexually motivated for me i'm sorry she was horny for him no sexually almost moder- sexually no, motivated know, know, well, who isn't horny for little nas x let's be real i mean true that man that man is fucking sexy he's, shit. he oh, is sex appeal yeah I, i'm not gonna lie um, it could be an next sex symbol honestly he could yeah 100 i'm not gonna lie it was so stupid i didn't sell my soul bro nobody sold anybody's soul it, it is the, people are so dumb <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's true. <laughs> I'm so sick of it. Like Charlie D'Amelio sold her soul. No, bitch. No, no. She just blew up. You wish that was you, huh? Then say that. Oh, you are fucking. People dumb. don't realize that once you make it in the music industry and you get signed by a label, you kind of got to play by their rules. Otherwise, you get kind of fucked. And it's like that, that. That might sound depressing, but you're also making millions of dollars doing what you want to do. So it's honestly not that bad. Well, I I don't know about millions. Yeah, but the publishing not to rights. Kill the, not yeah. to kill the mood, but yeah. No, well, no my no, mood's yeah, been he's officially right. killed. So thanks. Buddy. He is he is he's actually right with publishing like with publishing deals like there it's not you're not making millions you're making a million barely like yeah. Awesome, it's hundred percent right. But yeah, as you Jason get more saying, money from like you know. you, you get more money from like merch and stuff than songs and tour yeah yeah well, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. From, yeah. It's touring, touring and merch yeah touring. Uh, but as Jason was saying, you don't sell your fucking soul. You just pop off, dog. Just you become famous. It's, it kind of not sell your soul. <laughs> It's so funny. Hey, uh, my name is Lil Nas X, and I actually wanted to share with you guys like that I did this. You know, I uh, I found a really nice genre mix, and I attacked it. I promoted it very well. I did all this work to bring me to where I'm at. You sold your soul. Yep. You're you're the so devil. Dumb. You're the devil. How city Just sold white their soul women because talking and fucking shit popular. they don't deserve to talk about. Actually, shit. Actually, yeah. No more white women was actually just about that girl, like Ari said. Wait, I, I think Sa- I think Satan wants to say something. Yo, Satan, is that you? Hey, what's up, dude? I just wanted to let everybody know that I actually have Charlie's soul. <laughs> uh, bro, bro, wait, wait, bro, 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 wait. Oh, how much? Did how much did you pay for it? How much did you pay for it? I don't know what my line is. <laughs> 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 Come uh, improvise, you Satan, fucking I can't believe, I can't, I can't believe dude, Satan folded. Say, dude, just say five cents. Uh, roughly five cents. My dude, you got ripped off. I'm just gonna tell you that right now. The fuck you say to me, you little shit? Honestly. <laughs> well, all right, all right. Calm Bro, down, calm man. down. It's fine. It's well, fine. I get, he was just kidding. Well, it's well, a podcast. Well, Jokes are made. Well, I, I okay. guess I gotta take it back. I was wrong. Okay. <laughs> yes, yes, she did fucking sell herself. So like, what do I know? I guess. Satan, if you don't put I your pants, down. I want. I want to apologize for. I want to apologize for. I, I made a very stupid joke, and I. I have went against my values. No, you did that last I night. Said, my ass is still in. Bit. Just go back where you. Okay, Satan. Hey, Jesus. Hello. Uh, YouTube. Uh. <laughs> No, no, no! I actually, I actually did make 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 a bad joke. I was like, "Oh, go ahead." What did you I, say? I was, I was like, um, it was like when we're joking about the white woman, the white woman, and uh, okay, and, okay. And I just said we're actually misogynistic, and I it was just not Hooray. funny, and I fucking hate it's myself. Fine. It's fine. It was. Stop which, it. which it was man fine. isn't misogynistic? I hold myself to a very high. I I hold myself to a high standard, and it was just a corny <laughs> joke. It was easy, and I just went for it. Ah. Sometimes the easy joke is the funniest. You know, not gonna lie, you apologizing for it makes it funnier than if you hadn't apologized. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. That was a joke. That was a joke. That was a joke. Guys, the takeaway from this podcast is don't respect women and don't apologize for it. <laughs> Anyways, you know what's not Words a joke? By. What's that, man? YouTube promoting parasocial relationships, as Ari has brought before us today. I, I don't Please know if discuss. you guys have noticed. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if you guys have noticed. Uh, niggas watching this, I'm the one who brings the most topics to this to this shit. 
That's not even true. It's, it's me and it's we know it. True. He's actually been doing a great job about that. I wanted to congratulate Listen, him. Listen, so so Ari was like, all right, we're gonna talk about Drake, and we're gonna talk about uh, you know, Charlie D'Amelio, and we're gonna talk about uh this, and I was like, Well, we're gonna do a Satan bit. So who's really winning here? Who's who's carrying the weight of this podcast? You know what? It's still Harry. Like, I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna, sit down. Okay. Sit down. Okay. Sit down. You're telling a black Don't man. Don't make me to get Satan down. back. Telling a black man to sit down. Satan doesn't look at race. <laughs> Actually, I don't know what he looks at. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay. Yep. Let me talk about fucking YouTube. YouTube.com. Is this a fucking site that you're watching this on right now if you're watching it in, in video? I god I hope not. <laughs> I need you guys to understand that god, YouTube man. fucking sucks. They are so tone deaf like almost all the fucking time. Do you guys remember that back in the day when they did that fucking follow uh, follow black creators uh tweet oh, for fucking bit. Black History Month? Bit. I'll never forget bit. that. I'll never that, was, forget that. that was a good bit. Remember that, guys? <laughs> I yeah, I that. stole it. It was so fucking funny. But uh, they did yet another fucking tone deaf shit yet again on Twitter again. Fucking Twitter, like always. They they put out a tweet saying, Women creators are proof. <laughs> like Burger King. <laughs> that, was, that was Burger King. <laughs> <laughs> you, I can't YouTube believe they does it did too. that, bro. YouTube does it too. I can't. <laughs> Dude, that was the craziest <laughs> fucking shit. No fucking I bullshit. I can't get over that They tweet. really put their whole cock on the table and said women belong They're in the They're the kitchen. real misogynists. And he just no barely one, scratched the surface. And thought, and thought no one would have a problem with it. And thought no one would have a problem with it. It's so fucking funny. Oh, my God. Anyway, back um, on YouTube. By having a problem with it, you're actually enabling Burger King. I don't know what to <laughs> tell you guys. <laughs> well, yes, we want more good tweets. <laughs> oh, my God. But seriously, though, uh, YouTube put out this tweet uh, saying, creators are proof people can feel like family, even if you've never met them. Shut the fuck up, YouTube. <laughs> Shut the fuck. That is some dangerous ass shit you're putting out, bro. That is so fucking dangerous. I don't know how many times it needs to be stated. I don't know how many times, but YouTubers are not your fucking friends. They don't know you. They don't fucking know you, dude. Don't show up to their house. Please stop. You're f no one but knows YouTube, you. But YouTube said you were my father. Fuck you, YouTube. Honestly, like, I can't believe they would put out a tweet like this when, like, it's such a huge worry for YouTubers to to have these parasocial relationships. It's so dangerous because some, like, fucking mentally ill kid could, could see something like this and be like, oh, my God, I was right all along. They are my family, you know? And that's not a good mindset to have, and that's not a good mindset to promote. It's just Yo, not good. we got some cool girls listening right now. What's up, ladies? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I looked at our analytics. Uh, there's 1% of women at the age category above 45. What's up, Let's ladies? Let's go! <laughs> they probably joined after my episode where I was talking about cougars. Let's fucking go. Um, they keyword search? <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Hey, uh, women, hit me up. Uh, my my number is nine. Amari, Amari, he's 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 cheating. I mean, I I I. I mean, I am pro cheating. I'm so. cheating. You, what are you gonna what? do about it? Yeah, I'm pro cheating. You're cheating on your hand. <laughs> no, I'm just pro cheating in general. Get if you if you got if you, if, if, if you got to cheat, you just gotta do he's it. He's an idiot. I was, I was he talking, sucks. I was talking about Jacob. I was talking about you, bro. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, YouTube, uh, stop enabling. Please, please. Like, this is actual enabling. Please stop. Anyways, what we we have time to do one question. Oh, we have to do more than one. Um, Maybe Satan can answer one if you find him a good one. Oh, that would be nice. I would definitely love to answer a, qu a question <laughs> of, of Satan. But actually, can we Wait. just touch upon the devious licks? That was a good Are point, you? Jason. What? Yo, Satan, you know we already have a demon on the podcast, you fucking idiot. Jesus Christ. What? I never said that. I was just want to talk about devious licks. Oh, no, but, like, I'm just, like, you You just made me realize we already have a demon on the podcast. Like, what? 
But it's isn't he the king of demons? Well, isn't that his whole shtick? I mean, semantics, I buddy. I gotta confess, uh, he oh, is my he is. Satan is my dad, and he's just been trying to get in on my thing, and I really don't appreciate it because the dad keeps interfering. He's kind of is that why he has such a cor- is that why he has such a corny fucking Twitter account because he's a dad? He's kind yeah, because of- he's my fucking dad, and that's why I hate his fucking Twitter because he's my fucking dad. He keeps trying to outshine my shit. Like I got I got on Twitter, and then he got on later, and now he has more followers than me. Like what the hell, right. dad? Can I have one thing to myself? Fuck, man. Yo, son, it's me, your dad. Are you listening? Right now? <laughs> 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 Yo, son, it's me, your dad. <laughs> I wanted to God, reach out. I, I feel, feel like, God. If my I feel if like my fucking father growing, called me and opened up with that, that. <laughs> we've been growing apart. There's been a little distance between us. I'm in hell. You're in space. It's I would God, kill man. myself on the spot. Oh, I would kill my myself God. on the spot. <laughs> Oh, That's what my dad does. I mean, I mean, hey, son, are you there? I'm in tears, bro. He said, oh, oh son, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I, oh, God. That's exactly how every father sounds. Damn, I know you didn't have a father figure by the way you played that role. Oh, my Lord, bro. Anyways, oh, the king oh, of Bosnia my God. asks... I don't know where where <sighs> the, to put this in further discussion or something, but you guys need to talk about YouTube shorts, particularly the terrible ones. Uh, be at the annoying guy who screams all the time, the guy who points at text for the entire video, or the people who just steal content, etc. Why are you describing yourself? I don't YouTube- know what to tell you, <laughs> dude. Like, yeah, yeah the YouTube- shorts, idiot. YouTube just tries to replicate TikTok and then all the skunk and all the gunk of TikTok who try to like hold on to these fucking tiny, tiny pieces of clout, uh, they go th- to YouTube shorts, but the, they, the content holds no value. And like, except Bryce, good job, Bryce. You're trying to good harness job, the YouTube You're shorts. Doing a great job, dude. I'm tired of seeing your bullshit on my page, though. I'm tired of it. I. Sorry. The, the for you page of TikTok is like has an actual ag- algorithm to it, while the shorts YouTube shorts kind of just puts whatever the fuck like in front of your screen. Oh, yeah. Like, I, here, take this. I have a I have a complaint for um TikTok. Go for, for it. For some man. reason, TikTok out of nowhere recently started like every other like every like three TikToks in my for you page. It'll be like, oh, here's someone one of your friends follows. Do you want to look at his bullshit TikToks? Like, no, yeah, that's annoying. it's really annoying and it's that's really annoying. weird and I don't like it. I'm trying to find who this person is because I want to complain to Jason. Because You block him? <laughs> <laughs> Can I do that? Because I will. Yeah. Oh, oh Because uh, I may have followed a lot of, back in my GTA days, I may have followed back a bunch of like big GTA creators who just post clips and like I moved on and they still post their bullshit. <laughs> Ain't no fucking way. Bro, fucking Playboy Cardi just confirmed that a new album, Narcissist, is coming tomorrow. Hell yeah. Tomorrow? Tomorrow. Oh, it's going to be a... I don't, I don't get why these artists are like, oh, the album tomorrow. Like, that's fucking idiotic. Like, I'm surprised labels are okay with that. I, I'm, bro, the, with the way times move, everybody's like, oh, I'm dropping albums in two months. We already forgot in two months. I love yeah. how Tyler dropped. I love how people are dropping now. It's like, okay, it's it's in a week. Damn. Well, you need to be you need to release singles is what you need to do. Sometimes, but sometimes you don't. It's too late. People have the attention spans of skunks in headlights that are about to get run over by a train or something. I don't exactly. know. I don't. I'm like, perfect. Seriously. My attention this, this span thing is, is trying so normal. hard to be Kanye. I'm sorry. This is just Kanye. Look at this. This is how he announced it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga's channeling his Kanye right now. Playboy Cardi, more like Playboy Cardi. Was it? Was it? Was it him or was it Travis Scott, the one who was in that Batman suit that looked like? It was Travis. Cockroach. It was Travis. It was that Travis. Shit still kills me. That shit still kills me. So funny. Uh, let's answer right. some more questions. Agent Cox asks, "What is a question?" You always wanted to be asked, and what is your answer to it? Oh, my God. That's a good question. We're doing his job for him. Yeah. Yeah, That's That's kind of genius, actually. 
That's big brain. Uh, hmm. that's actually a thinker. That's really a thinker. Is it? You already have your question. No. Exactly. Then it's a thinker. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, honestly, I, 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 it's, I appreciate it, but can you give us like another week? Can <laughs> <laughs> okay. can this be postponed? We're tabled. Like, the rest of the episode is just going to be us thinking on this. One. Yeah, I, I really want to yeah. talk about the devious licks, but it's fine. We can keep it for the next week. Yeah, the, that seems timeless. The, the, seems timeless. Nah, yeah, I guess it'll be a nice time capsule because it will be over by then. Mm-hmm. Um, favorite albums, really quick, and we bounce out of here. Uh, sure. Uh, like of all time. Yeah, of all time. Uh, Where's that? For me, I think it's still uh, Ramona from Kill Bill the Rapper. That's Damn. a good ass album. Kill Bill the Rapper. You guys gotta listen to that. That's a good ass album. Never heard of it. I'm, I might check it out. It sounds fun. Okay, what, what about, about you, Austin? Um, an airplane carried me to bed by Sky Sailing. Mm. Who? Obama. Interesting. Still don't know who that is. What about you, Jacob? Um, wait, what was Austin's answer? He's gonna answer another a different Al City album. He doesn't want to answer this the, the same Adam Young album. <laughs> What's your favorite Al City I said, album? I said an airplane carried me to bed because I knew you would answer. Now. I think my favorite album. I have two. It's uh, it's either Dude Ranch by Blank One Eighty Two or Of June from Al City. Yeah, my answer is pretty easy. What is it? Joe Biden's house. 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 Goodbye, Cass, and goodbye, son. I will not be on the next episode. For this is Satan signing out.